Welcome back to Good Morning Sri Lanka. It is a morning show on MTV Sports and we have another guest on the show. And uh, talking about photography, I think that's an important skill a lot of people have. And this person over here is a software engineer by profession, but does his photography as a freelance job. And I think photography, in my opinion, is a job that you do for your pleasure. A very good morning to you, yes, Shah. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. Now tell me, how did this uh, begin in your life, and what would you sta say that your style of photography is? Okay, uh, I I started off. Uh, I, I like to document stuff. I like to okay. document things. So uh -huh. it, it all started off with that. So taking pictures of stuff that I, stuff that I do, stuff mm -hmm. that I wear wherever I go. Uh huh. So uh, it's that's how it started and. Uh, uh, in 2007, there was a play. There was a uh, play, and I decided to take my camera and then start clicking. So since then, uh, that's how it began. That's how it began. All right, from that point onwards, what type of uh, adventures that have you, um, you know, gone yeah. into? Yeah. So uh, whenever there was a theater production, mm -hmm. uh, you know, I, I would I would attend with the camera and I would ask, uh, you know, is it okay if I take a few pictures? So. Uh -huh. And they would allow because at that time it was it was something new, uh, uh, and nobody objected. So they're like, okay, you know what, fine, and uh, took some pictures, and yeah. Is it from that point onwards, not just theatre? Uh, you were involved in a lot of astronomy pictures as well, yeah. astronomy uh, photography, if we're going to call it, where you concentrated, especially about almost four years ago, on the solar eclipse that occurred here in Sri Lanka. Mm -hmm. And we do have pictures as well of it, and a lot more coming up as well. So as I go along, you could actually talk about those. Yeah. It, uh, I was an eclipse chaser. I mean, uh -huh. just whenever there's an eclipse in Sri Lanka, yeah, that's and this uh, is it. Yeah, that's one. That's one. That's one in Jaffna. Uh, so it's uh, Nalur Kovil. Uh huh. So I just took uh, yeah, and that's used lens flare for that. Just used a few filters. Okay. And uh, yeah, so it's just a bit abstract. So that's the the sun being eclipsed. Okay. Um, and you call and this the annual. This is the annual eclipse where okay. you know, it forms a ring. Uh -huh. uh, and uh, the center line of the eclipse passed through uh, Jaffna, so we were very close to the center line, and uh -huh. that's why we met. So, oh, this is uh, Venus transit happened uh, last year. All right. So, how many photos do you usually take to get the perfect shot out of the lot? Uh, Are you randomly click or no, no, you wait for that moment? Yeah, I wait for the moment. Uh huh. And you get it absolutely right on spot the first no, time you no, click no, it, or no. it's, it's about. Uh, but h half of it is bad. At least ah, half okay. of it is bad. <laughs> and you so just take it off. And wh what about this one? Th this is in 2007. Uh huh. Uh, it was in Arugambe. Uh, it was a, 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 a sunrise eclipse. Basically, the sun rose being eclipsed. Okay. Yeah, so we haven't partially. seen a full eclipse till uh, in Sri Lanka. A complete one. No, I the, guess. Two the one in 2000. That was the annual one. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Um, so we were just looking at what you've done so far. Yeah. Um, so you're concentrating mainly on theater and astronomy. Yes. Whatever other areas would you like to maybe in the future take turns and then concentrate on? Uh, portraits. I like okay. taking pictures of people, emotions, you know, their character. Yeah. Okay, so far you haven't touched on it. So it's sort yeah. of a diversification that you would like yeah. to enter, is yeah, it? I need, I need, I'm, I'm still new to it. I need to level up. I need to practice more, you know, study the subject a bit more. Okay. Yeah. Uh, would you... By any chance, um, have a plan in making this a full time, maybe somewhere in the future. Because right now you're doing this as a hobby, and I think it's good because yeah. it's it gives you so much of pleasure yeah. uh, when uh, you're you're free, basically. Yeah. yeah. Any idea? Yeah, I think it's a good retirement, uh, a good retirement uh -huh. <laughs> profession. Yeah. <laughs> Looking at the long term plans yeah. over here. Um, for a photographer, what do you think is really needed? A good eye or a good camera or both? Um, I think uh, well with me, I, I like to feel what I what I am uh, clicking, the scene, the person, you know. Uh, I don't make it technical. Uh-huh. Uh, what I do you mean you won't take it? Like it's technical. not a, I, I don't, 
it's I mean I take technical shots like if it's a product if it's a you know if it's a box that I have to photograph at a particular if I'm told this is a spec this is how it should look like then I will take that shot uh -huh. but uh, uh, take theater for example right so if there's a scene if there's some some ha something happening okay uh, I, I like to have I, I, I would like to feel what what the scene is feel the characters feel feel what's uh, happening and then go on those lines click compose based on that well, I think I've learned See, a even with the even right now. <laughs> yeah. What yeah. were you saying? No, even with the even with the eclipse, right? Uh -huh. So, it's not just uh, it's not just the sun that I've taken. It's just, I've, I've made something out of it. So, yeah, it's a bit abstract. So, yeah, a lot of big words are going to be used as composition, and then you know how to take the right angle and the lighting yeah. and everything. Every little bit has to come into play yeah. uh, when delivering a good photograph. Am I right? Yeah. Absolutely, I guess. Yeah, composition yeah. is more uh, more towards the artistic side. Mm -hmm. Technical te technical aspects would be like you know. The and both should come together, of course. Well, if you don't get the technic technical uh, aspects right, it's like writing a book with bad spelling. You know. Uh, nice, yeah. nice one. <laughs> <laughs> so well, we got the um, first half of it absolutely right. We're going to ask you a few questions more after the break, but do not forget that we always reiterate the fact that we got a huge number of likes so far on Facebook so you have to join us and then we are going to share the show on YouTube as well in case if you miss it do join us on www.facebook.com slash goodmorning Sri Lanka we'll be back